What is up guys and welcome back to another video. So today we're at Lake Meredith. Me and Cody decided to take the kayaks out today and do some fishing. It is very windy today, so the water is pretty choppy. The waves are pretty bad over here, but once it hits the dock, it kind of clears out. It's not so bad on this side. Get out of here. So me and Cody both got some string and we're gonna tie off to the docks and float out and then do some fishing. That way we won't have to worry about the wind dragging us off. Getting bites. Fish on, fish on baby. First fish in the kayak. inch crappie baby hell yeah gives me some hope probably been out here for an hour and this is the first bite i got so we came to the lake pretty late in the day around six o'clock and only had an hour and a half to fish i only caught this crappie and an eight inch catfish before we had to leave oh little baby catfish what what look at that little guy caught a little 8 inch catfish on a minnow. Look at that little guy. I'll go ahead and throw this guy back. He's way too small. I normally don't just keep one fish, but today I figured I would keep it and do a catch and cook video. So today we're going to be making some crappie fish tacos. So here is the crappie that we caught today. I'm going to go ahead and fillet this guy up. I went out and finally got an electric fillet knife, and this thing makes filleting fish so much easier. Now that the fish is filleted, I'm going to turn on the stove and add butter to the pan. Here is the fillets. I'm going to season them up. I got some Slap Yo Mama, my favorite. No, oh, this bottle is running out. Got some pepper and then some salt. I'm going to throw these on the hot pan and let it cook. While it cooks, I'm gonna look for some ingredients to put in the tacos. Honestly, I have no idea what to put in them. The fish is done cooking. I let it get a little crispy. I'll go ahead and give it a try. Oh yeah, it's good. So here is all the ingredients I will be using today. We got flour tortillas. I grabbed this bag of lettuce. It has iceberg and green leaf lettuce, carrots, and red cabbage in it. I figured it would be good to get a few different veggies in the taco. We got shredded cheese, 
the crappie I just cooked up and then some hot sauce and that is all the ingredients we will be using all right let's get started I'm gonna start with the tortilla I'm just gonna dump all the fish on it first Then I will add the veggies. If I can open it. All right, bag, you win today. So this lettuce is in big pieces, so I'm just gonna chop it up. <laughs> just kidding, I wish I was that fast. All right, there's the lettuce, and now I'm gonna do the same thing for the carrots and cabbage. Oh crap, I almost forgot the most important ingredient. How could I forget the ranch? So tartar sauce kinda sounds good in it too, but the tartar sauce that we have isn't very good. I don't know why, it's just seasoned different, so I'm not gonna use it. We will just stick to the ranch. All right, so tortillas, veggies, cheese, fish, hot sauce and now ranch so I already cut up the lettuce and now I'm gonna do the same thing for the carrots and cabbage now we need to add some cheese just kidding <laughs> And now the best part, the hot sauce. And now ranch. I'm not gonna add too much just because I'm worried all these extra ingredients is gonna outweigh the fish. All right, I'm gonna sprinkle on the last of the Slap Your Mama. Then a little bit of salt and pepper. And this bad boy is done. Check it out. It looks amazing. Oh my god. That actually looks really good. I was debating on making fish tacos tonight. And I've never made one before. This is my first time ever having fish tacos. And I didn't know what ingredients to throw on it. A lot of people cut up tomatoes and onions and I hate both of those. So I was like, do I really wanna make fish tacos when those are like main ingredients? But uh, I'm glad I did. This looks amazing. We have one crappie that we caught today on the kayak. My first fish of 2020 on the kayak so that was awesome and we filleted it up cooked it on the stove and made a fish taco and it looks amazing I'm gonna dig in there is a bunch of ingredients on top so I'm kind of worried that it might overweigh the fish but uh there's only one way to find out this will be my first ever fish taco which just happened to be my first ever fish of 2020 on the kayak. So here we go. Cheers. Hmm. Okay. At first, all I tasted was the lettuce, and I was like, okay, too much lettuce. And then afterwards, I got the fish. And it was pretty good. The fish is amazing. I'm gonna try one more time. Mm. Okay. The fish is amazing. I love the fish. It's spicy, tastes really good, but the carrots don't really do it for me. Not with the fish. And I put on way too much lettuce. So 
I'm going to try to take off some of this lettuce, less lettuce and more cheese. That's what I will do next time. Okay, there we go. I took off quite a bit of the lettuce and now I'm going to try it again. Again, the carrots, not very good. Should have left those out. Now we know. I'm going to wrap this up tighter as well. Make a little burrito. There we go. Mm. A little messy. Another verdict. That was perfect. But I was missing one thing. A little bit more ranch. I took out all the lettuce and now it's like perfect, but more ranch. I'm gonna go grab some more ranch real quick. And then it will be amazing. All right, we got some more ranch on there. Man, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, like the fish just, now that it's like very proportioned, the fish is amazing. So good, holy crap. So before I cook this thing up, like I said earlier, I was very picky on what ingredients to use. And I saw that there was a bunch of recipes for a fish sauce. I'm not sure what ingredient goes into that, but I was too lazy to do it tonight. It's already uh, 10 o'clock at night. So I was like, I don't want to cook that much. So didn't do it, but maybe next time we'll try it with fish sauce. But it's amazing with just this. For my first time ever making a fish taco, it's amazing, really good. I will definitely be doing this again. Everything I made with fish has just been amazing. I do love fish, but uh, it's just good. Sarah needs to try this, but uh, it's so good I'm not gonna share it with her. Sorry, Sarah. <laughs> again though, the uh, carrots. The carrots don't need to be in there at all. I like carrots. It just doesn't go good in this. All right guys, so that was the catch and cook fish tacos. I uh, enjoyed being out in the kayak and I enjoyed this taco even more. That was amazing. But I hope y'all enjoyed that video. Do not forget to like and subscribe. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.